and all Silver Shroud fans. I got an urgent mission. If you're a true fan, stop by the Memory Den and to talk to Ken Conley. The Silver Shroud needs you. Galaxy News Radio. A slaying in Scully Square. Just uh, down this alley. Well, well, well. I I'm just meeting a friend. No business of yours. Uh, perhaps I'll just call him. Now, if, if you'll excuse me. My work here is done. Or is it? What brought you to Scully Square, Mayor Murphy? A journey that left you dead and Boston leaderless. Why venture? Emerge from the shadows, villain, or face the justice of the Silver Shroud! Got the memory pod loaded up? What will become oh, of our star hero? Find out uh, what happens next week. Good neighbors, week. crazy. Bad murders, of... worse. Sometimes you just gotta escape a little to make it through the day. You've been listening to Galaxy News Radio, a holy own... I hear you. It's a mess out there. It's rough in the best of days. B but now, you ever listen to the Silver Shroud? Huh. That's what we need. No matter how bleak things got, he saved the day. My family and I used to listen to every new episode. You mean when they first aired? How? The last broadcast was hundreds of years ago. I was in cryogenic storage for a long time. I only just woke up. Oh man, that's amazing! You're just like Mr. Abominable from episode 83. Yeah, something like that. Boy, if you just woke up. The world these days must take some getting used to. That's an understatement. Things may look bad, but we gotta try to make it better. I got a question for you. What if the Silver Shroud was real? With his black trench coat and gleaming silver submachine gun? I got a plan to bring him to life. So we can fight bad guys and give the rest of us a symbol of something better. Good on you for trying to make the world better. I just have to do something, you know? I've built my own custom machine gun. Even better than the one in the show. But to make this work, I still need the most important piece. The genuine Silver Shroud costume herself. And they actually got one here in Boston. They made it for the TV show. Will you help? I might do it, if you make it worth my while. I can give you some caps up front. Just promise she'll help me. I'll get the costume for you. You're gonna do this? For real? Before the bombs fell, they were filming the Silver Shroud pilot over at Hubris Comics. So that's where you'll find it. You're the best.
Kent. There she is, pretty as the posters. The Silver Shroud costume herself. Together with my gun, everything's all set. Here you go. After all these years, the Silver Shroud is born again. But there's just one problem. I'm just not Silver Shroud material. I could be Rhett Reinhardt or, or his butler, Jarvey Blake. But the Shroud is strong. Capable. Come on. Don't sell yourself short. I got a better idea who should wear it. You up for being the Silver Shroud? You already got your own origin story and everything. What with the cryo vault and all. If I go along with this, I could use a little extra. If it'll get you to help, sure. I, I, I may be able to scrounge up a couple of things. Looks like I get to be the Shroud. The costume and gun are yours, so you patrol good neighbor's streets, and I'll call in any crimes on my radio station. Here Here's some calling cards, I guess. When you dispatch justice, leave them behind. That way, everyone knows the Silver Shroud has returned. Time to fight crime! Heads up. Tell Strong what to do. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is... Calling all Silver Shroud fans. A once-in-a-lifetime announcement. The Silver Shroud returns and he's gonna clean up the streets. Everyone heard how Wayne Delancey murdered Miss Selmy and her kid over a few lousy caps. Death is coming for you, Wayne. Galaxy News Radio. 
What's with the fancy dog? Walks the streets it looks of expensive. Boston, one man lurks Must be I found a new friend. You listen to the radio? Someone wants you dead. You threatening me? Are you threatening me? That's your last mistake, asshole. You mess with me. Jasmine. Chamomile. Pain. Ecstasy. This can only be a day of mysteries. Be still, sweet trout. I removed that scumbag slug, but you're sick with fear and still suffer. What a blood! Thank you! Shroud's dispatched justice already. Miss Selmy has been avenged. Shit, the Shroud off Wayne? Wait, so this guy's actually for real? Oh, you better believe it. So, Jerry, go on. Tell the listeners about what we're talking about. Right. So, AJ, you know the chem dealer by Bobby's. He's doing good for himself. Says he's got a whole new market. Kids. Even with his garbage chems, he's just breaking in the caps. You hear that? Sounds like the Silver Shroud has another bad guy to deal with. Uh, why? This Shroud guy, he's gonna muscle in on the chem trade now? No, he's gonna do something about it. AJ's selling the kids, and his chems Excuse have me. killed hey, people. Hey, AJ's gonna be clown. Kind of powerful friend. This is it. my turf, clown. Don't be a you can't let AJ and I don't kids. appreciate what you call him. Whatever. Trespasses. Galaxy! News. Peddling poison to kids, are we? Today, you face the Silver Shroud! Uh, <laughs> who you say? Oh, for Christ's sake. Did Kent put you up to this? He keeps moaning about the poor little kids. What the hell, right? Tell you what. I'll pay you... Let's say 50 caps just to shut up about on, it. Dollface. And uh, right maybe get Kent off my back. All right? Stop oh, selling to children. A miscreant. Or face my Stop. wrath. Paul, Screw you. Waste the freak. Special update. The villainous assassin Kendra was recently spotted at the third rail. The same Kendra who bombed little Joe Shack and killed four innocent drifters. If you want to see the Silver Shroud in action, stay near Whitechapel Charlie. The Shroud's sure to interrogate him to find the evildoer's whereabouts. Galaxy News! When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging for guilty. Hey, Charlie. My way for paying customers. Today's episode, like one of them wankers from the posters. Den. What you wearing that for? You look upon <sighs> the silver shroud. I seek a miscreant named Kendra. Shroud then. Yes, my oh, colleague. companion. Kendra is and not no, one to be trifled with. People associated with her have a habit of being found face down in a ditch. If you're set on meeting her, 
is actually for a fee it can be arranged. The master of it all. You're right. Can you spare a few but details on her at least? Dearest on the house. As murderous goes, I have positively prolific. Gallery. No percentage you say more. This it is not wise to stand between the silver shroud. Sir. And righteous justice. <laughs> justice? <laughs> you mean to end up? In that case, a flat's just south of good neighbor. All the street apart. Yeah, for the blighters she's got with her. Nasty piece of business, that. Good luck. By the shadowed streets of Selfie, one of the mob bots' heads is still talking. Alright, I am. I can't fix. Another special update. No, it wasn't Bobby No Nose who offed AJ and his goons. It was the Silver Shroud. See his calling card if you don't believe me. Now's our time, listeners. Justice is coming a good neighbor. You'll see. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Austin, the pain can be love any other than selfish Gallock. Now it's time to pay. Gasp! Fools, all of you! Attack my robot children! Destroy these interlopers! The robots are advancing. Kendra. And you. Your You're adjusted attitude has made allies of us Wayne all. Delancey's killer. Silver Shroud. You have no shall idea we? who you're dealing with. We shall. I do so like it when the little bug crawls willingly Stop into the right spider's there. Not a step closer. You may have, to you have taken children. your last life, oh, villain. You your stole my life. You. <laughs> Silver Shroud. He's armed. You're both a fear. Bad people may be coming. It's not safe here. Hey. I don't know you. Just, just go away. I don't know you. Just, just go away. Hey.
another headliner. Hancock seeks a special meaning with our hero, the Silver Shroud. Whatever it's about, be careful, Shroud. We're all with you. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Just uh, down this alley. Well, well, well. Looks like someone got lost on the wrong side of the tracks. Lost, lost. <laughs> yeah. Wrong side of the tracks. Oh. I I'm just meeting a friend. No business of yours. Uh, perhaps I'll just call him. Now, if, if you'll excuse me. Not so fast, fancy pants. Your wallet and that snazzy briefcase you carry. Hand them over. Now. I most certainly will not. Do you have any idea who... No. Good defenses. Hard to attack. Hey, Hancock. Look who it is. We heading out again? You still interested in traveling together? I think I could do with some more trouble in my life. Let's do it. Done. Look alive. Yes, sir. Playing dress-up is fun and all, but you walked into something a whole lot bigger. Those lowlifes you've been taking out for Kenny Boy, they all belong to the same asshole. And that asshole's gonna want some good old-fashioned revenge. You dig? So who is this asshole? His name's Sinjin. He's taken two-bit raider outfits and made them... scary. Small fish now, but if left alone... I happen to know where some of his other boys are. Smiling Kate operates outside of Bunker Hill. And Northy's got a pad over at Prospect Hill. You take them out, and maybe we can find out where the big guy himself is stashed. Good neighbor would rest a whole lot easier with him out of the picture. I'm up for some community service. <laughs> you know you're all right. You take care of Sinjin, and I'm inclined to show some gratitude. You feel me? Heard Bunker Hill pays off the Raiders instead of just shooting them. Where's the spoon in that? So glad you could all come up. Hi. If it isn't the boy behind the costume. Mm, you've been really naughty, Mr. Shroud. Making all my friends so nervous with your calling cards. Taking out Sinjin's favorite toy soldiers. But now it's time to rip your goddamned heart out! You kidding me?
engine. All clear. This is the Shroud's headquarters. So you must be the Silver Shroud's little friend. Oh, it's yeah. you. Oh, if you sure. want to see your friend alive, I told Shroud, Count all that hero stuff was going to get you both killed. Meet me at Milton General Hospital. Oh, God. Don't do it, Shroud. It's a trap. God. Save yourself. Calm yourself. Oh the it, Shroud do is it. here to help. Please, stop. Take That's down, what Shroud. got Kent into trouble Don't in the first place. A dozen raiders barged in and snatched him. Here's a silver when shroud they update. took him away, you they it, left Kent you a message. Just listen to Kent's radio Shroke station. Down. It what? keeps playing it over and over oh, again. Oh, God. What's happening? On your knees, dirtbag. What? What are you doing? Oh, ah! Sinjin, all clear. This is the Shroud's headquarters. So you must be the Silver Shroud's little friend. Yes. If you want to see your friend alive, Shroud, meet me at Milton General Hospital. Don't do it, Shroud. It's a trap. Save yourself. Ah! Ah! Oh my God! Do it, Shroud. Do it. On my knee. Ah! Tick tock, Shroud. Here's a Silver Shroud update. In case you missed it, Kendra's reign of terror is over. What are you doing? Wh ah! Sinjin, all clear. This is the Shroud's headquarters. So you must be the Silk. This is just the waiting room. Yes, there was real money in the suffering of others. Oh. Ah. Ah. Him. Time to reel him in. Something's coming. Gotcha. Ah. Do that one. Ah. Son of a... Ah. What a... Ah. Let me know what I can.
fucking hide from me? You You're dead. Say it again. Hold, assholes. Anyone turns heel, I'm coming for you and your family. And you, Shroud, you step any closer, and we get to see what's inside Kent's head. You shield yourself behind an innocent. You are craven, Sinjin. And you shall fall before me. Don't talk to me like that. Some of these losers think you're some sort of legend. Like you walk straight out of a comic book. Well, you and I know you're human and you're weak. You came here and for what? You little sidekick? I have cut a path through all your thugs. Who can truly say I'm not the Shroud? Don't listen, man. He's a phony. So what's gonna happen is this. I'm going to kill Kent. Then we're gonna shoot the hell out of you. Nothing's gonna be left but paste. Then, I'm going to Good Neighbor and kill every last worthless bastard there and burn the whole thing down. No one screws with Sinjin. What happens is this. Everyone that points a gun at me dies. Every last one. Jesus. Sinjin can't do anything to us if he's dead. Cowards! Cowards! Kent. I've never been so happy to see anyone in my entire life. That was close. I thought I was done for. For sure. I just give up. On all of it. Crime finance just isn't what I thought it'd be. If you just quit, then the bad guys have already won. You... You're right. But I'm tired. I just want to go home. I'm going back to Good Neighbor. Really, thanks for saving me. But I'm just done. Alive. What do you need? Job's done. Sinjin's dead. So down goes the big bad Sinjin. We get to walk that tightrope of freedom one more day. Take this for the effort. You have any other work? You've done plenty of work already, pal. Gutter's been running a little too red lately. You keep them clean, and you're welcome back anytime. <laughs> 